More breaking news. Ezekiel Elliott, the Cowboys' first-round draft pick, has been accused of domestic violence but has denied those allegations. A woman who claims to be Elliott's former live-in girlfriend has accused the former Ohio State star of assaulting her while they sat in a parked car early this morning, according to a police report filed by a Columbus, Ohio, uh, in Columbus, Ohio and obtained by ESPN. Now, Ezekiel Elliott has denied the allegations. He has not been arrested at this time. He uh, told police that he never lived with this woman. Four witnesses, including one who was sitting in the car at the time of the alleged incident, also told police that they did not observe an assault, according to the report. Let's bring in Dan Graziano, our NFL insider, with more on this. Uh, Dan, what more can you tell us about the Ezekiel Elliott situation in Columbus? David, really just that the NFL is looking into it. Obviously, over the past couple of years, uh, in the wake of what happened with Ray Rice, the league has moved to take serious steps to take domestic violence accusations seriously, overhauled the personal conduct policy in 2014, put in a system where a first offense for a domestic violence violation would result in a six-game suspension. Obviously, it's very early in this process, and we want to be careful since, you know, Ezekiel Elliott has not been arrested and has denied the accusations. But in general, if we talk about a, a player who's under this kind of investigation and is found to be guilty of something like this, it could be, you could be talking about a six-game suspension or more. Dan, obviously he was pretty thoroughly vetted during the draft process. Were there any red flags, anything suggesting this kind of behavior from Ezekiel Elliott in the past? To my knowledge, David, no, but I have to admit to not being, you know, I, I didn't cover him in college, so no, I, I don't, I mean, the Cowboys made him the number four pick. Obviously, if there were concerns like that, uh, you would hope that someone would have found them. I, I mean, for me personally, it came out of nowhere, but I, I don't know the young man. All right, so it's an ongoing situation there with Ezekiel Elliott and the Cowboys who have had their share of, of behavior problems on their roster over the last few years.